We lost one of our uh, vulture catfish females. We have uh, we have had uh, until now four vulture catfish, two males, two females. Um, many people think that vulture catfish don't grow more than a foot and a half. Even our males are more than that. They're close to two feet, just under, and the females are over two feet. This particular one, if it was tip to tip, it's 26 inches. Uh, we got them in 2015, so they're today's 2022, so they're about makes them about eight years old. As for the manner of death, erratic swimming for the last, I say, week something we've seen often here and attributed to bacterial infection that has been taking out some of our fish but vultures are very strong and have never others at least we had six of them have never been affected by it we lost two to predation so as I said now we have have had uh, four remaining and now we're down to three his uh, its skin took out some of the bites um, out of it, even when it was still alive, I, had, I failed to notice it in time. And before I took it out and put it in the hospital, the uh, big pieces of uh, adipose fin have been bitten out by by other vultures. So they're not really averse to cannibalism on their dying keen. Um, back to the uh, death causes. I'm not sure. I. Uh, I don't know how long they live. Maybe this is in captivity close to their normal lifespan. Although I would doubt it, but I would like to know for sure. Also in their early years they have been feeding a lot on the rather cheap and uh, pellets, Ziegler brother pellets aqua f for aquaculture called finfish silver. So they're not I mean those pellets are great if you want to raise the fish quickly and uh, sell it as food fish but it, they are no good for health and longevity they have a very pretty pattern on, their, on them they are not good for longevity so that may be one of the reasons some of our fish died a little bit too early because of the overall fattening of the internal organs and uh, eating terrestrial origin based feed um, we have a problem with another female it just started yesterday so right now it's in quarantine and it's the same thing erratic swimming so I I doubt she's gonna survive She's about as big, if not bigger, probably a little bit bigger than this one, maybe 27 inches. Yeah, she's holding on, but uh, she swims the same way. Radic, as I said. I mean, she doesn't know we're up or down. She bumps into things and swings upside down, lays on her side. Right now she's laying upright, but it, she doesn't know where up or where down is. So I'm afraid we're gonna lose her as well. Now two males. I think they're the ones that uh, took the bites out of the 
dying female. Look at that right there. So that's the last remaining of the six we got originally in 2015. From John Solas of Freshwater Tropicals in Fort Myers. Since they have appetite, since they partook of the dying female, I believe they have appetite, so they're not doing too bad right now, but we'll see. If the lifespan is really that short, these guys are next. I'm pretty sure.